Backstage, the Pepsi Summer Bash Styles and Roman. BB Rexa. What is up, girl? I like the Re Rexa. Rexa? It's, actu it's actually Reja. That's what Let's I thought. start it again. No, 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 no. Backstage. No, no, no. Of the I told no, 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 you. No, no, no. It's, it's Rexa. Oh, okay, but okay. In, in Albanian, it's yeah. Reja. Yeah, Reja. Reja. I, I told him that. Reja. You, Reja. Reja. you should just go as that. Reja. Uh, that sounds dope. I don't know if anybody will <laughs> it's, it's too hard yeah. to pronounce. Right, right, right. <laughs> <laughs> so let's talk about it right now. How does it feel to be back in Chicago performing at the Summer Bash tonight? It feels amazing. I mean, this lineup is insane. I'm yeah. just, I'm just honored to be here. Yeah, you know? absolutely. And it's like kind of the, like the, 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 the radio show of the summer that you look forward to. Yes, I absolutely. You Eric, know, did you hear that? I, I like that. I That's agree. amazing. Like the one you've had circled forever. Like you know, hell I yeah. For that one. The I mean, no, it's like one. it's a pretty bit. It's yeah, just the it's lineup dope. is dope. Yeah, you know what I mean? Calvin dope. Harris. Yeah. So I mean, like I know Ariana is, Grande. Yeah. Have you heard of Ariana Grande? Who? Yes, no, exactly. No, no. Right? Exactly. I'm joking. I'm joking. Ar Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande. You, yeah, you, should yeah. say that, you should say that to everybody, to the Calvin Harris. Yeah, yeah, Harris. Welcome, Calvin Harris, to the he stage. He would punch us in the Mike face. Mike Nicki Minaj. You, Are can you, make, you can make anybody ethnic. That's awesome. You have a yeah. great talent for that. I don't know. I mean, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, did you bring Nicki Minaj with you? Yeah, is I, I Nikki, put her. She's, Nikki, in, she's, in, she's in my luggage. She is. Uh, I cut her in half. I put her ass in one luggage. <laughs> yeah, and yeah, yeah. I, I was gonna crack the joke, but thank God you did. Because <laughs> well, did you buy Nicki Minaj? I mean, the single is doing phenomenal. No broken yeah, hearts. I'm awesome excited. song. How yeah. did that collaboration come together? Um, we did Hey Mama together, yeah, and then David Guetta. yeah, with David Guetta, and um, I did No Broken Hearts, and I was like, man, I want this to be like a female empowerment record. Yeah. Yes. So um, you know, I usually get my heart broken, and I was like, in, I had my emo stages, so I'm like, I'm out of that now. <laughs> so I was like, so I'm like, now I'm gonna write a song that's yeah. about feeling good. Um, and then I was like, okay, let's, let's I played it for Nikki's manager, and then so we sent it over to her, and I'm like, okay, this is gonna be like a. Cause he he gave me a disclaimer. He's like he named names. He's like we passed on this person, this uh, person, and this person, uh, and they were all other female artists that were like really big. Okay. And I was like, okay, makes me feel really good. Right, right. Um, no, but then she heard it and she like jumped on it, loved it, yeah. like redid her rap to make it perfect. Oh, we cool. shot a three-day music video, which is doing amazing. Which, yeah, like, so blew by huge. So yeah, many views. I know. Yeah. I'm like I'm like wow, people like this video. It's cool, yeah. you know. So um, and that's how that came about. You know, I was just so I don't know. It was so cool and so yeah. dope. And uh, the thing is, a lot of times when you would collaborate with art, other artists, they don't really. They're not really. They don't talk to you. They're never. They're never really involved. Mm -hmm. But like she. I learned so much from her really? and like yeah and at the video she like gave me like she gave me advice and she's like you have a long journey ahead of you and just keep going at it and always do what you love and know that it's going to be tougher for women in the music business mm -hmm. and just always say what you want but say it in a nice way and I don't know it was just I was pretty cool it was really nice it's, yeah it's funny because uh, like Nicki Minaj is amazing and some people may not think that Nicki would do that yeah. You know well what I mean? Because Take you time see out to talk to an artist. Yeah, because like you that. see, like you see a female rapper, and you have to think about it. She's a female rapper. She's mm -hmm. a black female rapper, mm -hmm. and she came from Queens, New York. Had to make it for mixtapes, mm -hmm. and there's a lot of things that you go through as a female. Just to deal with Lil Wayne and Birdman <laughs> every day. Come on, <laughs> gosh. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, I'm sure she's like the queen of the that whole group. Yeah. Oh, without no, a doubt. Yeah. You know, but you see Nicki Minaj, and you don't know, and you know, you expect just like diva, but like she's actually really dope. And what I what I learned from her was that she's actually just very clear on what she wants, and mm -hmm. she's actually just. Like she just, I don't know. I was, I think. And she's what is genius. that exactly? What does she want besides meat, uh, mail, and money? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> in, that, in that order. In, in that, that order. order. <laughs> I think I think she, I think she's like any other normal girl who just wants happiness and just wants to like awesome. love. and just want and just great. wants love and just wants yeah. to make amazing music and just yeah. and, and perfection because when we were at the video she could have easily came and did her part and been like okay I'm out but she literally would step and look at the camera and be like I don't think this shot is epic enough how do we make this video epic that's I don't cool. want to do basic stuff that's I want to awesome. do I want to make an epic video and yeah. that's what we did you know I feel like I'm really proud of that being like a first big really moment for myself and you, you know, know what it's like only of, levels you know speaking yeah. of big moments for yourself and epic you just said What's up with you and Entertainment Weekly, girl? What? The magazine? Is oh there a yeah. big spread? Oh, oh, oh yeah. what, what, man? You oh know what? what it is. Oh what? What is up with this big spread? Uh, what I is know. it, five pages, I heard? Yeah, and my mom saw it. She was, like, really happy. Yeah, I've, been doing, I've been doing Don't a lot be of humble <laughs> right now. This is your time <laughs> I've been to doing a brag. Lot of, this I've is been doing so a lot cool of, for you. I've been doing a lot of magazine stuff, like, a lot of fashion stuff now. Like, especially I did something with just with Fendi recently, and mm -hmm. it's, like, come, it hasn't come out yet, but it's, like, really, like, dope. And I'm like... Me? Cool. <laughs> and for guys, for guys watching, Fendi is a bag. It's a, it's a, no, it's oh. not a bag. It's a very expensive designer. Yeah, it's a very expensive. Yeah, Italian designer. And, yeah. No, it's really cool, and like it's run by Karl Lagerfeld, who's like, um, like, um, like amazing. Yeah. He did Chanel, so not this that you care, probably. This is for the guys. We just like lost all the viewers on this part. <laughs> every all the male, every male. I'm like, yeah, yesterday, Old Navy had dollar flip flops. Did anybody go out there get those? Which was awesome. Which was awesome. I honestly, I like the dollar flip flops too. I like mixing it. 
I like, I like, there you go. I like, I like the twenty, I like, I like the twenty dollar Forever Twenty One top, and then mix it with the Dior Hell sneakers, yeah, or like, absolutely. or like yeah. the dope ass pants mixed with friggin' Tim's. Absolutely. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, I think there's, I, I think that's the whole, the whole vibe of fashion. Yeah. I hate people who walk around. They're like, my outfit's twenty thousand dollars. It's like, who yeah, cares? but you still look like, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> buy a house, oh buy a gosh, car. How excited buy are you? Buy a car. I'm like, am I? Do I the not excited? I mean, you look so excited, but we're so. I mean, we interviewed it before with Cash Cash. I, I like remember that a long yeah. time so ago. And, and I mean, let, let's oh take, my let's, god! Let's take back. I, had, I had black hair, everybody. <laughs> you, did, you, did, you did. And yeah, I was a totally yeah. different human being. You were, you were a different human being, but you like were, what? you were just as cool. You were just oh, as cool okay, back then good. as you are now, which is one thing. That's well, because you know, before you were all laid back, though. Now you're like all Dior and everything yeah, like that. Yeah, like, what? Yeah. No outfit. You, you know what I did yesterday? You know what I did? You know what I did yesterday on stage that I didn't like, and I want to, and I want to make sure that I'm always humble. I had a really expensive pair of leather pants on stage, and I went, I went to go because it's a part of the set where I twerk. Okay. And I can't wait for that. Part. That's gonna right, be awesome. Yeah. Well, because I do Turn a medley. I do a medley of like the songs that I've written, like Hey Mama and the Monster, and I'm like I give I give the story behind the, the songs. And and on Hey Mama, I do my my I whip a nay nay, and I literally rip these leather pants, and yes. I was like, I was like, damn, I just ripped these like dollar pants. Oh. Like, so I said, no, you, you gotta tell us price. how many, how much were they? I spent a thousand dollars on that. What? But I, and I, but I'm these not shorts were fifteen bucks. I'm not happy about it. That, and I was like, I gotta humble myself. I can't be doing that. Yeah. I'm like, that's not cool. You know that's what cool. I mean? That's cool. You're, you're, you're at least humble enough to know that that wasn't a good look for you. These are, these are fifty dollars. So okay, there so you go. And they look amazing. There you go. And this was free. So yeah. <laughs> See, who doesn't love free All stuff, right? right? So, so <laughs> BB, I, I, I always ask uh, amazing songwriters this because you're a great, great songwriter. You always have been. Yeah. Do you? Is there? A, what's the different joy you get from like hearing the monster, Eminem, Rihanna? Yeah. On the radio, compared to hearing your BB Rexa song, or yeah. me, or me, like me, myself, and I are no broken hearts. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. It's like so much cooler because I think that I, I've always like uh, you know growing up, mm -hmm. you know when you're like five years old, you don't say like I, I want to write Britney Spears right, song. Yeah, 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 right, you know, right. you're like oh my gosh, I want to have that feeling of, of being on stage or hearing my you know record on this radio. Yeah. Um, I honestly, it's just like you kind of like it's kind of like a fairy tale. I know it mm -hmm. sounds corny, but every time it plays, I actually sometimes get nervous, and I you could ask my manager like I change the station because I get nervous. Really? And I just, no, because I'm. Like this, I don't like. I want it to go on forever, but yeah. it doesn't. And like songs have their shelf lives, mm -hmm. but it's kind of like yeah. an amazing feeling. There's a, nothing because like because you're it. a great songwriter. It will go on forever because yes. you write the next hit and then the next hit and the next yes. hit. Yes, it's, it's it's like awesome. It's like uh, you know, when you when you write songs, you, you people, you know, you never die. You yeah. know what I right, mean? Right. So like, if you're an artist that just has your songs written for you, you have it's sometimes there's a shelf life. The only yeah. thing that dies are thousand dollar leather pants. They R.I.P. When you twerk on stage. R.I.P. thousand dollar. I'm wearing I'm wearing I'm wearing I'm wearing stretchy pants. Tonight. Nice. Okay, so good. How, right. how much are those? Um, I don't know. A designer made them, so I don't really know. Oh, oh so high maintenance. No, again. hey, you, no, we, we, I did it. Hey, we could talk to you all I day. We could talk to you all day, but we're getting the rap signal. So again, BB Rexa, right. cannot Bye, wait guys. to see your show tonight. Give it up for BB Rexa. Yeah. Woo!